Hi guys, it's Dawn from Let's Make a Mess today. Um, I got a uh, comment from Tracy that she'd like to find out how I made these um, little envelopes from um, when I posted a flow that I did online. And these were actually made from, um, isn't that a beauty, from calendars. But I don't have any calendars because these calendars were calendars that people left at work and nobody wanted them and so I snagged them and while I was at lunch one day I went ahead and just created a bunch of these um, envelopes. So uh, I don't have any calendars at home but I do have some some uh, spare paper. I had this um, drop cloth or drop sheet. I have some old-fashioned so 80s, right? Um, wrapping paper. It's really good quality too. Um, some other wrapping paper, a map that I got. I think I got this from Samantha Owen in our swap and music sheets and then some more of that drop cloth. I like both sides so that's going to be a tough one. Um, I believe this came from Monica. I don't remember though and I think this came from Samantha as well. But I really like this. I kept part of this so that I could just actually use these as words. These are, that's great little... Um, sheet to have in your arsenal. So anyway, basically you just cut these into a perfect square. Uh, it doesn't matter what size. You can have a small ones, you know, you can have them as small as um, something like that. You know, I mean, and you can make a little tiny envelope. These are just, they're just no fuss, no muss envelopes. And um, so what you do is you basically, you fold it in half and then you find the center. So you fold it in half like twice and you find the center. And then you put a little dot in the center because that's going to be where you bring in the sides. Because you want to bring in the sides in order to have the bottom come up and over the sides. So you bring in the sides, you fold them in, fold in the sides, and you fold in the sides. And then what you're going to do now is you don't glue them because you need to go down. So what you're, what you, where you're going to put your glue is going to be right here and right here, right? So you're only going to glue these two spots. Um, you can glue all the way down actually into this little corner as well. And I'm just going to use an Elmer's glue right now. Um, it doesn't matter. Um, you probably don't want to put too thick because you don't want it to... Uh, smoosh out. Okay, so there's the Elmer's glue on that side, there's the Elmer's glue on that side. I wonder if that's going to be a good choice. Oh yeah, it is, and then I just need to put more. Okay, my bad. This is going to be a rather large envelope. I'm just going to stick some here. All right, that's fine. And then we're going to just stick some here. I'm gonna do a few of these, so don't no worries. You'll see it by the time I get in, you'll you'll be an old pro. Just make sure that there's no glue on the inside. You know, you don't want it to glue, and there's not, so the way we did it is fine. Now some people cut this off. I don't like to cut it off, I like to fold it under. So first I fold it forward just to get a nice like crease. It doesn't have to be perfect, you know. I swear anything I do, if I can do it, you know it's not perfect, right? Because I'm doing it. And I am the queen of not perfect. So there we go. And then we just fold that in like so. Okay. You know? And then you can decorate these. I like it like you saw this morning, I used these in um my um my swaps. And this is what I put the little things in, little bits and bits and bobs and that kind of thing. So yeah. Make sure they're on there nice and good, nice and secure. I love Elmer's glue. You know, I saw it on sale the other day, and I should have just grabbed it just to keep you feeling this, but it's all good. So there, there's number one, and I think we'll figure out how we want to um, embellish that later. You can or can't. You can, when you send it to your person, you can, um, you don't have to uh, embellish it. Um, you can also, if you want to get fancy, put a Velcro on there. That's not a bad idea. Just put a Velcro. Um, you can, when you close it up for your swap, you can use, um, what did I use? Jeez, I don't think I used anything. Hmm. 
Yeah, I don't know why I didn't, but you know, you can just use some washi tape. Maybe I did and I don't remember, I don't know. But so there's number, there's the first one, okay? And so let's do another one. So you wanna fold it in half and then fold it again. And no, I don't care about the creases. I mean, somebody might have a better way where you don't have to deal with the creases, but honestly, I'm not, I don't care. <laughs> How many times do you guys hear me say that a lot, don't you? <laughs> yeah, you probably hear me say that an awful, awful lot. And it's not that I don't care, it's just that I don't, I don't wanna stress about that kind of thing, whatever it is. When I'm saying I don't care, it means let's just not have any drama. No drama. So actually when you fold it up a little bit, notice here you wanna come up a little bit, like maybe, I don't know, an inch, just so that you have something to cut off. You know, up here, not cut off. You can cut it off if you want to, but just so that you have something to, um, and you know, you can get your bone folder, and here's my, my bone folder. There you go. I, you know, I don't think I'll ever buy one. Watch me, never say never. So I'm gonna go ahead and put my, um, my glue here, and then, you know, I'll have to glue it again. We know that, because we saw that on the other one. This is slick paper. So, I wonder how it's going to fold on there. Okay. And then we're gonna do some more on each side. Let's do it on here so that it doesn't have to be perfect. Perfect is perfectly imperfect is perfectly fine with me. Look at that, that one's kind of giving it, I've never seen it do that before. It's old paper kind of wobbly, um, we'll, we call it, I don't know, there we go, there, now it's not, no. again, check on the inside to make sure it's nice and dry, feels dry to me, can use a little bit more right here, I think, just a pinch, this is pretty, isn't that pretty? So yeah, I mean, any, you can use anything. I prefer ca calendars because that's a good way to use them up. Um, but this is a good way too, right? To use anything. There's so many cool, um, envelopes out there to be made. You know, this is just a real simple way to do it. I'm all about the simple. I'm all about the drama. Low drama, low stress. So again, when you come down, you want to, you know, have a little fold here, like a little, you know, both sides, you want to bring it down, you know, so there you go. You know, that'd be cute. You can put a little bling on it. Maybe we'll do that in a little bit, you know. I don't put them inside, you know, I don't know. I just do on the outside. Yeah. So that's kind of fun. I'm sure there's fancier ways to do it, guys. But this is the, the, the no fuss, no muss way. Here's another old uh, wallpaper that I've gotten and used that before in uh, swaps. I'm sure people will recognize this probably as a piece of a uh, page. Towards the center on both sides where the dot is. Go towards the center where the dot is. And then just fold it up. Remember, right here, about like an inch. So you just want a little bit, you know, you don't want to do it right here because it won't look, it, you know, what do you, because if you do that, then you're going to have that, right? So you just want to bring it up a little bit. Plus, you want more to be able to fold under. Make sure it's kind of straight on the sides. here, and then a little bit right here, you don't want to do too much because you don't want it to smush out towards the, if you smush it this way, that'd be a good idea because you're going to get, see, it's probably, it'll probably smush it to where you need to bring it. <laughs> Telltale ice uh, noises in the background, I'm in trouble now. Yeah, it's the weekend. 
Hey, it doesn't have to be the weekend for me to enjoy a glass of wine. It's just, you know, I'm just saying. I don't know. I don't have too many. That's about all I do that's probably not real good for me. I haven't been exercising uh, the last couple of weeks because I haven't felt good. And I think even um, not exercising has made me actually feel worse. So, um, yeah. All my walking, hiking buddies are like, where are you? Um, I didn't even go to step class last week. But then I thought, well, I had an awful lot to do here at the condo when I was doing all that moving of stuff. You remember that? Did I tell you about that last week? I was doing so much stuff. So I, um, I just kind of, my back started hurt. Blah, blah, blah. Let's not go there. Anyway, okay, so let me fold that back. Some people cut that off. I just don't like cutting that off. I don't know why. I, I like, I think it just adds, it makes it a little stronger. The more paper you leave on right there, right? So these are super cute. This is a cute one. And I'm just going to go back and look how they're doing. They're doing pretty good. This one's got that little... I don't know why that one side, that's really odd. But that's okay, I don't care. It's paper. And it's an envelope. And it's fine. So we already have three going on. Three going on. Let's pin this off there. A little glue there. These are big envelopes. Big, I mean, relatively speaking, compared to the ones I made with the, you know, with the, yeah. And it's okay if they're all kind of creased. I mean, maybe it's a better idea if, I mean, these started out kind of, I started out um, folding them diagonally this way. Probably not a good idea. Just always start this way, you know. Just do that. Don't do the diagonal thing like I did. So that's where I, why they're so creased. I probably don't need that dot there, but for me, I need it. That's cool. I wish that was on the outside. I'm, oh, I like that one. I'm leaving that on the outside. Now i got to figure out where the dot is. It's right. Camera Close enough. I love this as the... As the... Um, this flap. Right? So you can see what you like. See how that's gonna look really pretty, pretty cool right there. So yeah. Actually, by pushing this this way, the glue goes that way, and you don't really need to add more too much. It's pretty good. So that's kind of a new development for me today. Didn't notice. I didn't notice that before. One. I really like this map one. It's pretty. Not pretty. This is my fave so far. Everybody, you can have a fave. It's okay. <laughs> this is my fave. My fave. Oh, crooked, but that's okay. I love that. I love their where they did that. So yeah, it's cool. Let's do a few more. We got more to do. I thought, why not just music sheet ones? We use music sheets for everything else. You know? Mm -hmm. Don't really need that little dot, I don't think. Let's do it this way because that side's a little...
That's cute. See where it's coming apart there? The, the glue will take care of that, won't it? We will take care of that. That's super cute. I haven't done it in the music sheet before. I'm sure it's been done, but I haven't done it before like that. So yeah, this weekend I have been a crafting fool. Um, I, uh, I really miss it during the week. And then last weekend was my weekend to do a lot of work around the condo and I'm sure I did something I don't remember I'm, I know I crafted but I didn't relax I was doing busy doing the couch stuff so I didn't do that kind of stuff and um so this weekend I said I'm just I mean I could have went to work today like I had overtime I could have done so I had so much to do but I said no that's okay not gonna do it today Plus, I was really annoyed at somebody I work with, and I don't actually work with her, but ugh, gross. It's like, oh, I don't want to go in. I mean, we all have people that we have to work with that we don't, you know. You just have to deal. And nobody I work with watches this. And, well, one person does, but they know they know all my deep dark secrets are working. In. He's my best friend. Him and his wife are like my best friends. So I don't think they watch. Because they're not this kind of crafter, but anyway, the person that I'm being a little nap negative about right now does not watch. She's too busy doing other unsavory things, in my, in my opinion. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, so there's that. Okay, let's do this one. This one looks like like I'm I'm torn. This side or this side. Like, I have no idea, but this is the, not, this is the side that all of this leaked through on. And I just absolutely love them both, so I'm kind of torn. I don't know. I like this side because it has some glitter on it. So, what do we do? We do this side. Yeah, that's what we do. We do the side, the outside. It's so pretty, right? Isn't that pretty? That's gonna be a pretty envelope. So Tracy, I hope you're be able to see how this how simple this is and incorporate this into your daily arting or <laughs> whatever. You know what I mean? Like if you do swaps or something. We need to do another swap. Um, but again, I'm trying to de-stash right now. I'm going to be so out of stuff, though, and I'm going to be begging everybody, please send me stuff. You know, but the fun of it, I have to tell you, I think the fun, half the fun of doing this kind of mixed media is going on the hunt to find it, right? I mean, I know I'm right, right? So, how's that for being confident really though I love that like tomorrow morning I know it's Saturday morning and I know that my friends of the library is open and it's all I can do not to get up tomorrow and go to the friends of the library and I just might have to I probably will just because if there what if there is a book but this is how it's going to change around this messy craft space is um well first off for those that don't know, I just went through a whole, um, I decluttered my house. I must have taken five, I did five or six boxes of books to the library, not to the library, to the Goodwill. And they were, you know, books that I used in art and stuff or were going to use in art and got them thinking I was going to use them in art. This is turning out really cool. And then I, um said, okay, I'm not going to do that to myself anymore. I don't want to get to the point where I can't move in my own room because I ha I share my room with my, my crafting. You guys, seriously, look at this. This is turning out like, that's a really cool envelope. If I don't say so myself. 
think it's done, right? So anyway, um, you know, you could cut this off if you didn't want that, but I don't, I'm not worried about all that. Anyway, so back to my thing. So, um, I decided that I am not going to, I don't need that. Um, I don't think I need that. Maybe I don't. Clutter up stuff so much. I'm going to, if I need something for a project, then I'm going to go find it and I'm going to use it for that project. And then I'm going to get rid of it. And if I need it for, I'm not going to save things for projects. Because I can't, I don't have the space. And it was, my problem is, is I am, I don't like a lot of stuff. And this um, type of art, you're going to get a lot of stuff. Like, like Liz says, you'll have that. It's like, oh, I don't want that. No, 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 no. I can't have that. So, um, I don't want to have that at all. It was like, it really weighs heavy on my mind. You know, it really, it just does. I'm just not a, I'm not a stuff kind of person. I look at stuff and I start getting very stressed out. Too much stuff. So I went through and I cleaned everything out and I've got a, as a matter of fact, you, I have a one single car garage and my daughter and a single space outside and my daughter usually parks in the outside space and I park in the garage, but you can't even get into my garage right now. It's full of stuff that we're having a garage sale on the 20th. And, <clears throat> and so, um, yeah, a lot of stuff has got to go. I just, and plus I'm like, I got a new couch, new curtains and that kind of thing. And so I was telling you this why. Oh, because I don't collect a lot of stuff anymore. I don't know why I was telling you that. I was, I had a point. I think my point was made. But anyway, so yeah. So, anyway, so I am making things as I need them. And then I'm going to, you know, there's certain things I can't get rid of right now, like the lace and stuff that I have. I mean, that's expensive. So, but books in a different language, I've kept, I've looked at a few pages and that kind of stuff, but um, there's just no way. Oh, look, this is totally crooked. That's not going to, that won't work. So, you have to cut it. Um, it doesn't have to be perfect, by the way. Let's see how it works. Good enough. Um,. So, yeah, I just, um, I really tried to, I still have to go through and do a few more, um, run-throughs on my stuff. So I'm de-stashing and that kind of stuff. Anyway, and, but I do love the hunt. That's what I was trying to talk about, is I love the hunt. And it's really hard. So, oh, you know. Some I know what I could do. I could start a business. I could be a crafter's um, crafter shopper, right? <laughs> That's what I could do. I could say, if you don't have time to go shopping for your stash, send me money. I'll go shopping for your stash because I love to do it. I'll send you your stash. You pay me for doing the shopping and stuff. And then I don't have to ha ha go shopping for the stash and... You know, I have all this stuff in my house, and everybody's happy. You have your stash. I went shopping. I found the hunt. I did, you know, all that. So, I think I kind of got too much glue on this one. Let's just give it a second here. It's not terrible. It'll be fine. It's 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 a very lightweight, um, but it's cute. Eat cake, happy birthday. Oh, it's a birthday. And it doesn't have to be. You could say eat cake or. Wishing you a happy, sing and laugh, celebration. It doesn't have to be just about birthday. Celebration time. Wishing you a happy day. Whatever. Okay, so. Yeah, so I'm drinking my Pinot Grigio. Guess where I got it? And I'm in love with it. But I'm hoping it doesn't make me sick. Um. I don't think it will, but I have a very sensitive tummy, and lately it's felt a little bit more sensitive than usual, so I'm trying to be careful, so I probably shouldn't be having wine, but I don't know. 
What else am I supposed to do? Anyway, um, Trader Joe's. Two buck chuck. That's what we call it here in Southern California. It's really good. I mean, it's not, you know. But I'll tell you what, I like it. My favorite is Barefoot. Barefoot Pinot Grigio. Four, it looks like $6.99 a bottle. It's my price point, and I really like it. You know, this turned out really cute. All right, so there they are. I hope that you're able to... Um, okay, well, those were already made. So here we go. We've got... Make sure that everything's not sticking, not sticking. This one might, so I'm going to leave it open a little for a second. This one is my favorite, so this one's my favorite, too. Like a mother. Oh, this is my favorite. Uh-oh, oh, it's sticking a little bit. See, you got to watch that. Make sure you go through. What I have is a little plastic thing that I stick usually, but that's at work. You know, I even have a stash at work. I probably should go through it. This turned out really cute. I mean, my wishy. It was wish. This is a good one, too. It's nice and a big pouch. I'm not going to put Velcro on those because, you know, I just use them to, like I said, to share ephemera, that kind of thing. So, there you go. You don't need to sew. You don't need to do anything. But right now, why don't I... I'm going to bling them up a little bit. I think what I'm going to do is just put a little bling on each of the tabs because that'll be cute. But first, why don't I decide what can go on here? Just a little something, not a lot. To me, um, simpler is better. So there we go. So I'm going to grab my, my, um, on there that's cute I know but it, it is cute I'm gonna go ahead and put this on here and then we'll put a little something on it okay let me think should I use a glue stick yeah I pulled out a new one so I'm going to grab my glue board. You know, I used to just use this glue book in the book, but now I just take it out and use it and then throw it away and then rip another one, rip another one, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Because I'm going to throw it away when I'm done. Yeah, I live in the 805. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so I couldn't have picked a worse um, hobby, right? Look at this beautiful, like, um, language. Well, I don't know if it's a beautiful language, but it is a very pretty font. This is a baby, baby, um, baby washcloth. You can get them at the Dollar Tree or the do 99 cent store or wherever. And um, I saw somebody else use these online. I think it was caged fish. I'm not sure. And um, so now I do that when I'm gluing. This is going to be so cute. Okay, so we'll just start with that. I'm just going to go through and put like one little thing on each thing. It's too big. Probably not too big for that though. But I don't think it looks that great there. This might... That's pretty. I think that'll look good on here, though. Upside down. Actually, I want to put something. Ooh, this was my fave. We'll put that there. That's pretty. Also, there was somebody on um, online tonight. Um, 
And she, oh, I wish I remembered her name. I mean, I read it and I thought, what a brilliant idea. Let's put this right in the middle. Um, and she said she's going to create a junk journal and she's going to put all of her favorite things in it and stop hoarding them. Isn't that great? A great idea. There. That's awesome. That looks so cute. So I'm not, I don't know if I'm going to do all flowers, but you know, that's kind of just how this is starting out. I don't know. Let's see what else we got. Ephemeris from some people. Butterfly might look cute on that. Your two tweet. That's so cute. That's really cute. That does look cute there, right? I mean, I know it's not grungy and. Okay, never mind. That's got to go there. <laughs> Looks like these flowers are finding their homes. I really enjoyed making them. I love making them. I guess I should make some more. Um, yeah, it was fun. You know what I need to make? I totally need to make... I'm doing this upside down on purpose because I don't want to read it. I, I totally want to make myself a journal of... For an art journal. I really like the one that I'm using. You know, the one that was inspired by um, Liz. My um, business card one. But I want a bigger one. And I was looking at different sizes and stuff. What I really would like is a Midori, that kind. You know, I, I, cause I really didn't know what that was and there was somebody online asking, well, does somebody want to do a Midori swap? And I was like, I don't know what that is. So I didn't respond. I don't respond if I don't know. <laughs> so if there's not a really good explanation, if you don't hear from me, it's because I don't know what's going on. Oh, I think this telephone thing looks really good here. I like that telephone thing in, but let's see what else we can find. This is pretty. Maybe a double double thing. That's kind of pretty. Those colors look good together. Oh, that got lost in there, didn't it? Hold on, hold on. Oh, that bird is so cute. Thank you, it would be cute because it is a like a well, that's pretty there. Pretty there too. I love this little fellow. I think Sam Samantha gave me that. I'm gonna save it. I'm starting to collect some vintage things. They're hard to come by for me. So, oh, that's cute. I just cut that in half and use it as a thing. Oh, St. James Place. Oh, that's cute. Wasn't that the least expensive one on the board? I don't remember. I do not remember. Ooh, you know what we could do? We could, uh, we could do that. Could do that. How about a little, how about a little lace on something? Okay, first off, I kind of like that on there. And what I want to do, though, is I want to poke a hole in it before I put it on there, put some, um, some, something through it real quick. Right. Like these, because it's orange and it kind of goes, and it's just cute, just a little added something, so. Okay. I don't have a, I think that's cute, that's fine. I could use this one, it's different, but it works. This, I don't like these scissors. They, you open them too far and you can't close. Don't make a liar out of me now. Never mind. That's fine. Nobody probably would have noticed but me. Okay. So yeah, if you guys are wondering, gosh, she's been doing an awful lot on art, like crafting and posting and... I don't really have a life. This is, you know, my life is, um, I don't, I just go to work and come home. And I don't really need to do anything else right now. 
I don't really want to do anything else right now. Honestly, I really don't want to do anything else right now. This is what I want to do. It's so funny. I feel like I'm trying to make up for lost time. But that's a whole nother... That's cute right there. You know, it's a thank you. Thank you for swapping. Thank you. Cute. All right. These are turning out awfully cute. There is one thing I do kind of want to buy, and that's some better, like, pens. Um, for, um, crafting them. Very good. What is this? Oh. Nothing. Okay, what do you feel good with this one? I think, I honestly do just think this. It kind of breaks up the pink and... Really? I think I have a better one. Ooh. That's not good. That would go somewhere else. That is so pretty. That's kind of cool. you got to remember you're going to put like something in the middle. So let's go with that. Remember, I'm trying to use it. My Ooh, I like that side better, actually. Isn't that funny how that works? No, because it just really does. I just going to go with that. So yeah, if you want to know how to make these flowers, go look at Shannon Green's um, website. She's going to be live tomorrow morning. Oh, by the if you, by the time you see this, it won't be tomorrow morning. <laughs> It'll be some other time. So I ended up using up these flowers, and that's okay. Okay. There's that one. And we've got two more. What in the world are you going to put on a meat packing? What would go... On a meat packing. Do I have anything have anything like cow related? Isn't that funny? I think I probably have something. I got a chicken. I got a bird. Maybe that one just calls for nothing. You know, because Hi guys, I'm back. Something happens to happening. Um I keep losing you, so I don't think you missed much. I didn't do anything else. This was the last one I did, and I think you got that. So now I'm working on this one, and it's beefy, and I don't quite know how to do it. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put a funny one on there and and then move forward. Um, I might be running out of space on my phone. You know, I just... Um, I don't have a fancy webcam or anything. You know, I'm not saying never, but, like, right now that isn't happening. So... Yeah. Um, seems to be okay now, so I'll just move forward. I said you like the long ones, and so I'm making some long ones. And I trust me, I know that I am not a pro, but I think that I, you know, I offer um, a little, a few little um, interesting things that I learn online, and then um, I sure learn from you guys. And when you ask for stuff, I love to, um, to. Uh, Actually, that's cute there, so let's go ahead and do that. And then a, a little yellow like flutter, flutter by. Okay, let's do that. And this is cute. This came from Carol um, Wagner, I believe her name is. Gosh, if I just munched that, I'm so sorry. It was so sweet. She offered everybody in Sugar's Candies. If you haven't heard of that, you have to go to that group. It's a wonderful group. Everybody's so supportive and nice. I just love it. I think I'm probably one of the first members, as long along with a few other people, and um, it's it's a, 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 it's just a wonderful group. I think I'm gonna go ahead and just go straight on this. So, well, straight enough. <laughs> there we go. Anyway, it's a wonderful group, and if you haven't been there, you gotta go check it out. Sugar's Candies on Facebook, and um, it's oops, like whoop, whoopsie, something just lost there. Something or other. We'll make some new ones. We know we have the technology to do that. So anyway, okay. All right. So it's all good. And what I've been doing with these. Oh, this one didn't get anything. Let's do something real quick. What are you gonna get? Wishing you. I don't think anything. Let's just go with wishing you a happy birthday. Is that good? No, it has to have a flower. I'm trying to use up my stash, and I want to just make everything pretty. 
And then I want to go get some bling and uh, bling up the stash. Put this star right like that. I actually like it in the middle, but I'll move on to the just to be different. All right. Okay, so that's that. Let's put these where I've been putting them out of the way. I just love this. Oh, and again, I want to make myself a junk, a Midori style journal. So if anybody knows how to do that or can help me figure out how to do that, let me know. Um, I really want to do that. So, oops. Okay, so here we go. Here's the envelopes, and they're looking, they're really good. They're not, they're good in size. Can hold a little bit, you know. So let's bling them up, shall we? That one's pretty. I think that one's a done deal. Well, let's call that one done. we got to put a bling on the back, though. We don't have to do too much to these. Um, yeah. So, stickers. Do I have some cute stickers? Or I could cut something out. But that... Well, I don't even know how long we've been at this, but... Um... Uh, what I'm going to do now is what? What am I going to do now? I want to add something to these, but I don't want to. I wish I had. You know what I could do? Hold on one second. I have, I have, an, I have an idea. I have punches. And I'm going to punch out and glue um, some ooh, little flowers and I'm going to use what am I going to use? some odds and ends grass I could just use this it's not as pretty as it would be but let's just see Fine. It's perfect. I love it. It's just enough, just to get. It's not. It's not huge. It's probably not the best size for that. But again, these are only envelopes that are supposed to. Look at that crusty fingers. That are only supposed to hold a little bits and bobs. So. Oh, really? There we go. I might use some Elmer's, but that's cute, right? I think that turned out super cute. Oh, my hands are so dirty. Oh, great. You see, you can go in there. Just don't come up here and bug me, okay? Stay back, child, stay back. I think my problem is, is I tend to do everything in such a hurry that it's not necessary to be in a hurry, but I'm afraid things get too long and drawn out. And I know that long is good, but boy, I think I could go for two hours, and I don't really want to do that. For number one, it takes so long to up... up. That's backwards, but this, we're using that. It takes so long to upload. It's cute, right? Okay. Yeah, it really takes a long time to upload. Oh, I love that. So cute. Mm, she's just going to get one because... Well, because... What is her name? Aunt Acid? Auntie Acid? Or Aunt... Auntie... Auntie... I don't know. Auntie somebody. She's cute. Let's give her another flower. She needs another flower. There we go. There it is. So there, you guys are gonna have this to wake up to in the morning. I did it especially for Tracy. Try to do. I try to. You know, if you guys ask for something, I love the requests because then I go, oh, I can do that. You know, it gives me a chance to be, you know, um, crafty. Give me something to do. 
and um, then I feel like I'm doing something for you. Makes me feel really good, actually, you guys. I don't like that flower. It's ugly. I, I ripped it because my my. Uh, oh no, I didn't. It was because of the um, because of the paper. So yeah, my daughter's out tonight with her friends. It's Friday night. That'll happen. You will have that when they're teenagers. And I told her, I said, oh my gosh. So I had to buy her prom ticket tonight. Guess how much that set me back. 90 bucks for a prom ticket. And that's not the dress. That's not, you know, I want to be, it would be kind of funny on here, wouldn't it? Because that's way too big. So, but let's put a couple in there. Anyway, so, um, yeah. $90. And that's not the dress and all the other hubbub that goes along with all that but I really want her to do that I didn't go to prom so I want her to have that experience gosh she's such a different kid than I was thank god <laughs> my mom said just you wait I said, well I'll be careful that I try not to to do that we have to do something with this one I don't know what yet but I think we'll leave it for now and we'll just go ahead and bling these up I feel like I have to hurry, you guys, but I don't know. Let's wet my fingers a little bit. I need to get some baby wipes. I threw them out. <laughs> I actually did. I actually threw out the baby wipes. I threw the baby, baby wipes out with the water, didn't I, Gracie? Anyway. There we go. That's better. Who needs baby wipes when you got rags? Okay, those are the old ones. We don't care. All right. So... Let's see what we got going on here. Super cute. We gotta draw some. Um, we have to draw something on here because you can't have a. This is another. Video. I've never found a set of pens that I really like yet. Yeah, that's better, right? Okay. If I draw st stripes across it, it'll look like it's a B, and I'm not going to do that. So we're not going to just even go there. <clears throat> okay. So I just want to put a bling, like a bling. I kind of wanted to put a bling, like did that turn out cute. I wanted to put a bling on each backing. What do you think? Is that where I should put the bling, or should I put it in the middle? Let's think about it for a second. Get the bling. I'm gonna just put the bling, put the bling. Maybe in both places, I don't know. Let me think. Let me have a sip and think about it. Oh, I have those little buttons. I have buttons. You know what? That's a good idea. I do have buttons. Where's my buttons? Oh boy. Finding things after you've organized is like nearly impossible. So now I don't know where the buttons are. Where in the heck would that be? Well, since I can't find my buttons, which is really, really annoying right now, like, well, I kind of know where they are, but what a hassle. All right, we don't need buttons. We've got bling. Buttons would have been cute here, though, too. So, let's just, I've got tons of bling. Lots and lots of bling. Let's use these blings. Oh, these hearts are cute, too. I don't use those, but I don't use those up. I don't use, here's some buttons. Hmm. And that'll help it close, you know what I mean? Like, be a little heavy. So, I'm going to use one of these purple ones on there. Yeah. I like that. And then, so we're going to need this kind of glue, probably. All right. You can probably all see where I'm going with this. Mm, those are the smallest. 
Actually, no, there's some pretty tiny ones in there, but they're not. It's okay. So what do you think? Isn't that cute? All right, let's just do that. Let's just do that. Big old glob of glue. Boom. Okay, that's going to be that. And then I might come back and put a... I should have done that first. You know, I'll just do this and then... Um, you know, let's not make the video longer because we'd have to wait for this to dry in order to put, or should I just do it and just be done with it and then pray. And I'll put a black, that's what I'm gonna do. I just don't wanna not leave them finished. So there we go. Go. Okay, now I feel better. So we've got a button in the back of it. Can I help it hold in there? So this one's finished and we will stick it off to this. These are turning out way cuter than the ones I did before. This needs a big, big, big thing like that. So why don't I just stick that on there? There, I'll do that. This is a good one for right there, it's pretty. It's kind of small, but that's okay. Hey, there are little envelopes and that's fine. That's cute, I like it. And again, I'm gonna use a little purple button. Let's stick it right there. So see? It's very cute. Very cute. Let's stick it off to the side to dry. This one I want a little black one. I think, or do I want this gold? Or do I want the black? I love the black. You know, I've been leaning towards black these days in my art and in everything that I'm doing. Wearing, painting. Speaking of painting, I wanna do a, um, I wanna do a, uh, I'm gonna use a black one on the back too because I don't wanna put a purple button. This one, I just wanna keep it like grunge. This would work, well, I wanted to be there. There you go, you're there. Um, I want to do a canvas someday. Let's do a pink card on here. I want to take an art class. <laughs> That's what I really want to do. Just can't afford it. $90 prom tickets. It's like, my gosh. You know, when you have kids, you think they're going to get cheaper as they get older. That doesn't happen. Don't think so. Not... Yeah, dream on. No. They don't get cheaper as they get older. They do not. They do not. Just saying. They get more expensive. Cars, insurance. Clothes. Paula, oh, she's really good about it. She'll go to the thrift store with me. She's she's awesome. She goes, that's cute, right? Kind of a she. Uh, went to the thrift store with me a few months ago. This one's a little odd, but it's okay. And she, um, I was looking all over for her. I couldn't find her anywhere. I was looking around, looking around. I'm like, where in the heck is that kid? And it didn't dawn on me until I looked to the back of the store and she was in the men's department looking at the Pendletons. Or, you know, the they're not Pendletons, they're flannels. I was like, really? <laughs> it was so funny, it was so cute. I'm like, are you sure you wanna buy an old man's, nasty old man's flannel? <laughs> She's like, we'll wash it, it'll be fine. I'm like, okay. That's pretty cute. I hope you guys like this because you might end up with them in your swap. I'm actually thinking about doing that. Um, let me put a pink one on here. I think it would be pretty. I wanted to do a pink one. I don't want to do a huge pink one. Well, let's just do a pink heart. So, um, yeah, we we'll probably end up in a, in a swap with you guys. I'm looking at that swap, um, that inchy swap online. I'm thinking about considering that, but I just had to get past the today. 
where I felt completely overwhelmed. You know, I felt completely overwhelmed with all of the swaps that I had to get. Like two, <laughs> but it still was a lot for me. This one I could use a little bit. Color. Mm. Yeah, black is fine. I think yellow would be cute on here though. Right? Yeah, that's, that's fine. And on the back, let's do a pink heart. Because that's cute. Why not? Why not? How about a white one? It's better. All right. So there we have it. There's the envelopes. And I even actually took some time to bloom it up. Gracie, don't even think about it. It's not happening. So now they just have to sit and they have to um, dry. Very cute. Gracie? Oh, that's fine. I'm going to move this out of the way and just shove those right there. Let's take one last look at each one. That's very cute. Move it over a little bit. Before it dries that way. So there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed um, these envelopes. Aren't that, isn't that pretty? I really like that one. I hope you liked it. I should do that more. I should hold it up to the camera a little bit more than I do. I'm really bad about that. Here we go. My lighting is terrible, but I moved my this white lamp over to the right, so hopefully it doesn't end up in, the, um, in here anymore, like where it was over there. And this is another fave. Very nice, very cute. Yeah, that'll hold a lot of stuff. You know? Love that. Love that sound. So yeah, nice little, nice little envelopes to share your, share your stash. <sighs> well, okay, I hope that that wasn't too long. I know some, some, some of them get too long, but I know some people like the long ones, and so I hope that you enjoyed this over your coffee or your glass of wine or whenever you have a chance to, um, to craft. And uh, I love that people are. Um, giving me awesome comments and, and requesting things that if you see again if you see something you like let me know I'll send it if I can um, might take me a while uh, if you see something that I can improve on I'll be happy to you know take your um, your uh, advice I like I'm new at this so I appreciate it anyway I okay I'll talk to you guys later have a good one bye